It's spooky season, and in the city of Portland, haunted spaces and ghostly places can be found hiding in plain sight. And as Halloween lurks around the corner, we're creeping into some local bars filled with all kinds of spirits. Fox 12's Bonnie Silkman has more. As we found out, in the city of Portland, haunted spaces and ghostly places can be found hiding in plain sight. Creepy, huh? As Halloween lurks around the corner, we are creeping into some of these local spots for ourselves where you might feel like someone or something is watching you. Many bars dial up the doom as Halloween creeps in, but some keep it spooky year round. Here at Creepies, the name of the bar says it all. Despite these faces on the wall, it's fun here, we promise. And as customers take in the interesting crowd staring back at them, they might realize they're no longer just a bar goer, but part of a strange circus where many eyes could be watching. This many clowns being around, it just started getting uh, labeled a clown bar. So the slogan had to fit in, not a clown bar. Because it's not just clowns. It's not. We, we offer a lot more than just clowns. And that just kind of fed into a pretty cool theme for a bar. The owners of Creepies clearly have a passion for collecting the strange and unusual. It's something they've been doing for years, and Portlanders can't get enough of it. They love taking in this interesting crowd. Some of these guys might take you by surprise, too. I think it's a beautiful bar. I like, uh, you can sit up here and play I Spy with your friends all night. Plus a little liquid courage and a bite to eat might help calm the nerves. Lowe's runs our kitchen. He makes uh, some pretty fantastic smash burgers. The cocktails, one of our most popular ones is the uh, pickle teeny. If pickles and clowns aren't your thing, how about an old haunted manor? Where cobwebs and jack-o'-lanterns fill a towering room lit by candles. Me and my partner, uh, we both just really love Victorian architecture. Um, so our dream was to own like a Victorian uh, style house. Instead, Rebecca Vega, the co-owner of Raven's Manor, says they ended up with a huge Victorian style bar with plenty of space for their own collection of oddities. You are fully immersed and stepping into a different world. This building's from the 1880s. Um, it's one of the oldest buildings in Portland. Is it actually haunted in here? Uh, yes, I'm not even kidding. And I'm not somebody like who thinks everything is a ghost, uh, but I would say a majority of our staff has had strange experiences. There's been a couple of people who've seen like a figure out of the corner of their eye. We've had like things mysteriously fall off the walls. We've had uh, paranormal investigators in here. I would say it's haunted. And at Raven's Manor in Southwest Portland on the weekends, they also do what's called elixir experiences, basically a cocktail class and maybe a few surprise guests. For now, reporting in studio, Bonnie Silkman, Fox 12, Oregon.